Hey YouTube, David50BB here to give a review for the Radio Shack Electronics Learning Lab. I think this is a great product for its price of $70 because it allows you to make a vast variety of circuits. It only comes with a little over 200 circuits to test out in the books that it comes with, but the design possibilities are almost infinity because you have the breadboard here and then you have all these springs connected to all these different devices and you also have a bolt-in voltmeter right there so that's pretty good I think seventy dollars was a really good deal considering the possibilities that you can have with this thing and it's really really been a good uh product, device, whatever, because it has ver really taught me a lot about electronics. I didn't think I would know this much this quickly. I highly advise you go through workbook one, basic electronics, transistors, and integrated circuits, because this will teach you the basics of how to do everything. And that comes with about a hundred easy projects. If you already know a little bit about electronics, or you already did workbook one, you can go straight to digital logic projects, projects, which basically explains or teaches you how to make circuits that use integrated circuits or ICs, which are the hearts of calculators, computers watches, cell phones, etc. I have done this circuit that you see here from this book. I have done almost all of the circuits in this book and two or three successful circuits out of this book. Now when I say successful I mean that I made a mistake not that the console itself didn't work I made a mistake with the wiring circuitry and just to not bore you by just staring at some blank thing I'm going to turn it on to show you what this does this project came from the digital logics projects book and I'll show, flip to that page and show you it right there This just has two alternating flashing LED lights controlled by this potential potentiometer. Yeah, long word. Potentiometer, that's it. And with the potentiometer, you can adjust it to make the lights flash faster and flash faster, alternating flashes. Until it's almost blinking nonstop. To the camera, the lights look solid, but they're actually not. But anyway, th this was a uh, probably one of my hardest circuits to make because of all the resistors that I used. I had to build one circuit and then change. I had to change this resistor up here and this resistor right here. And that, those two were very hard to get to. As I said, I think $70 is a really good price for this because it's, it comes with so many components. You got a voltmeter there that would cost 20 bucks at Radio Shack. You got three potentiometers here that would cost probably two to five bucks each. I think it was a really, really good deal. And I would highly advise getting it for yourself or for anyone you know who wants to learn more electro about electronics or who already has because this provides great opportunities to design new circuits and once you design your new circuit you can go out and get the materials to make a permanent circuit so yeah I give this probably seven or eight out of ten stars just as a fairly precise rating 
reason why 7 or 8 instead of uh, 9 or 10 out of 10 stars is because it could have gone down a little bit in price, maybe to 50 bucks. And they could have given you a little bit more selection of uh, circuits to make instead of a lot of basic ones. They give you two or a little over 200 of some circuits that are fairly similar to each other that do something just slightly different. And that's why I give it a 7 or 8 out of 10 stars. So anyway, get this from Radio Shack or from eBay or from somewhere. Try it out yourself and uh, let me know what you think in the comments. And uh, like this video if you want to. Bye bye till next time.